Okay, I think we're going sort of. Oh. Oh. Ah! Yeah, you look at my, Yay! Look at my computer. devices! Oh boy. That's gonna go too. Anyway. Ooh. Ah! Ooh. <laughs> Our computer's fun? I don't know why OBS has decided to start doing this now. Um, it won't remember like basic device settings like what's been plugged into it most recently, so I have to keep recreating cool sources for stuff. But anyway. Um, hi, Internet. I'm yeah. Dustin. I'm Lorraine. It's still crummy and shitty and cold out. It's warm. And I got up feeling a little stuffed up, just a little out of it. So the other week, wasn't last week, right? Because we didn't do a thing last week. We didn't week. do anything last week. Yeah, yeah, we had a bunch of stuff. To, we had a lot of stuff going on last Thursday. Uh, the other week, we did some art, and it was kind of silly and kind of chill, and it helped me uh, sort of zone out a little bit. That's good. So I thought, why not do some art again? Sure. Why Woo! Not? Amateur art hour. Yay! Welcome to the Art of Thursdays. Art of Amateur Art Thursdays. Not um, Amateur Art Thursday. So yeah, uh, in honor of the Iron Banner. <laughs> that banana. <laughs> Destiny 2's contentious PvP mode. We're the reason people hate that game. Um, that's not even true. That's someone, what that guy sent us the other day. Someone sent it to uh, yesterday. <laughs> He's got his... I thought it was funny. He's got a poopy diaper full of doo-doo. You know it. Um, but anyway, uh, yeah, we're gonna, I'm gonna draw on slash over slash in yeah, reference to the Iron Banner logo. Draw the Iron Banner I don't know what we're gonna do exactly. We're gonna wing it a little bit. I'm working on Salad Man over here. Uh, so we'll see how this goes. I'm just gonna fuck around for a little while and then at the end... I'll end up with some interpretation of something like that. True. Got a computer mouse. I got the tablet thingy. Lorraine's, uh, once again, gracefully loaned old bamboo tablet. Uh, yeah. I got the keyboard uh, when needed. And, yeah, I'm going to use some combination of all three of them yeah. to draw something. I mean, you've seen my setup. I do a combination of, like, on my tablet, I have a keyboard. I've got... Uh, mouse which is handy for certain things i've got a pen mm -hmm. right now i only have my pen in my fingers on my surface and easy the other thing the one thing that i have decided mm -hmm. with this picture because i'm actually going off of a um set this down here for a second an action figure that i guess was made um <laughs> mcfarland toys uh fully armored saladin uh without with his helmet on and everything uh action figure for reference because this is very detailed and extremely helpful to have um i'm gonna put him in crocs and i don't know what else i'm gonna do with him um i kind of he's in this picture he's holding an axe um so that's in front of most of his body so i'm gonna make him hold something i don't know what but it's probably not going to be the axe um i'm not sure what that something is going to be it'd be like an animal crossing style bug catching net because i think that would be hysterical um, think of anyone, if people manage to be in the chat, I don't know if anyone's here or not, uh, and if you think of something that he should be holding, you let me know. The nearest quest to 555. No, that's just me. Okay, that's probably sufficient for just Yeah. Uh, can we make players up? Uh... Layer above here. I don't even know what I'm gonna call it yet, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna start messing with it at this point. Um. Okay. Now, where do we want to go from here? Uh, just for the sake of argument, go up to this all this filthy shit. Yeah, that's why I was. That's something that would be good to go over I'll with. I'll try to use the power of my shitty, shitty hands. I believe to... in your hands! Yay! Uh, I guess hands. I should keep that kind of close at hand. Swap these. Salad man. Put the keyboard down here in front of me. He's a lot more <laughs> intricate than Shaq's. Drawn Shaq's like twice already? 
Yeah. One for uh, once for Christmas and one. For... Oh, I'm not even on a tool. I'm still on the sheet. Thanksgiving. They were beautiful, dumb pictures. Fairly similar to the uh, mm -hmm. ribbon one I did for Christmas this year. I think silly destiny cards are. Technically a cod piece. One thing that's kind of bad about this action figure is it's a little grainy. Because uh, I had to make the image bigger. Mm -hmm. I don't want that slide though. What? Oh. The one I was going to whip up. So what you could do is uh -huh. like color behind it, unlike last time. So if you leave this on a top layer and then color behind it, you'll be able to mm -hmm. worry a little less about... I um, around that corner. Corners are hard sometimes, man. Straight lines can be easier than curved ones. Do you have a, um, any difficulties uh, yes. drawing in Every one direction or another yes. relative to your... Because I'm left-handed, so I, here's my left hand. I have difficulties uh, It's in backwards because that's how cameras work. Um, <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Why do you think most of my stuff faces left? As a handy, capable, left-handed individual. Uh, I just don't know if there's, like, some strokes that are easier for people oh, one absolutely. way or another. Or, uh... and, and that it can even vary from person to person, not just, like, handedness. Some, well, there are going to be some things that are just easier... For a certain, uh, mm -hmm. I guess, handedness. Because like you said, this thing, I never did bother to like mess with this to yeah. see if I could program these programmable buttons or whatever, but those are basically useless to me unless like I was able to flip this, which like you said, there is probably a way to do too, but uh, like I'd have to take my hand off of it and push the stupid button anyway, uh, as opposed to if they were on this side. If they were on my freehand side, I could just kind of press them. Um, I've actually been learning a little bit more about that kind of stuff, like handedness for art's sake, mm -hmm. uh, at work. Because one of our, um, one of my coworkers, one of the other decorators, she is left-handed, and the rest of us are right-handed. <laughs> there were a few, there are a few other left or left-handed See, people in the shop, kinda... uh, and they have to like have the wheel rotate different ways when they're like throwing. Uh, I'm gonna do this, and then I'm gonna like undo it and do it. If repetition can't get me like, and repetition is eighty percent of the law. Um, it was almost oh until I did that. Have you listened to any of my art streams where I'm constantly saying how much I hate certain oh strokes? Oh my god! Now I gotta yep, push the go. button. Okay. Hold Maybe on. I'll put like Never a mind. beach towel on him. I'm gonna give him a big shovel, like a big beach shovel. It's... This is salad man at the beach. Maybe I'll even put sunglasses on him. Iron Banner is all about repetition, Phil. Thank you. So stupid in these Crocs. Is there, shoes already kind of look like sandals to begin with. Like, okay. I don't know if you've ever looked at Saladin's feet, which, I mean, you do you, friend. Um, I mean, you know me. I'm always filling in those Destiny characters on wiki feet. I know you are. Uh, Some of us are doing the Lord's work. Um. But his, like, I don't know if they're shoes or, what are they called? I mean, part of armor. Sandals or? I don't know. Are they shoes? Are shoes part of, like, armor in Destiny? <laughs> I mean, boots probably. Boots, I guess. Uh, could maybe call them greaves, although I think that's more greaves like the, the shin. Yeah, that's like the leg part. It's not really the foot part. No. Sure, we'll call them clogs. Um, what? yeah, I'm just gonna go with this. Good enough. Man, good enough can be good enough. Um, but they look kind of sandal-like, and I just thought Crocs would be funny. Was so why not uh, traumatize this poor already PST man? PTSD, that's the one. Uh, by putting him in Crocs and putting him on the beach. 
your saladin. All your friends are dead, and your shoes are ugly. <laughs> That surface pen, that doesn't have any buttons on it, right? Nope. But the, your other tablet does, because it's more, kind of more similar yes. to this. Does this button do the same thing by default, where it like lets you move the... No, I mean, well, the programs are different. I think they I guess do that's true take too. different things. Because like the, um, that click is the eyedropper in Clip Studio Paint. Okay, well anyway... the back is, I think, I think I changed it to the how hand. How do you um, hold it? Because what I'm doing right now is I'm just like rotating it so my finger's not near it at all. Because if I try to do this, I mean, I, I just end up pushing it on accident anyway. I sometimes rotate the pen while I'm holding it, like not even thinking because I do that with pencils and pens. Um, but I generally just don't touch the buttons. Yeah, there's one giant button on this pen that when you there's click it, at least in Paint.net, it uh, it gives you, it lets you move the the canvas as opposed to drawing a line. That is a very helpful thing. No, it is, unless you're not trying to do that. Yes. So. Then it is unhelpful. Unhelpful and bad. That's me. Ha ha. So you know how Crocs have those little, um, mm -hmm. like the loop part? Do you think Saladin would wear it in the front so it's more like a slip-on, or would he pull it up in the back as like an ankle guard to keep the Croc on his foot? I don't know. Right, I'm just going to let that fly, because this is also a tree, so... It is a tree. I mean, it's a naturally occurring thing. That's a lie. It, Trees aren't natural. It looks all scraggly and bad. That's... Uh, you know what? Nature is scraggly and bad. That's what I say. Suck it, Mother Nature. Not quite that bad. Oh, though. he looks really silly without his arms. And his shoulders. Fuck <laughs> nature. Okay. I wouldn't go that far, Phil. That seems to be a very intense opinion, but sure. So I've had, when I decided to draw Saladin, I kept thinking of how we call him Salad Man. And now I have um, a Piano Man in my head, but with Salad Man in its place. And it's driving me insane. That's all. Hopefully I've cursed everyone else too. Join my suffering. Oh, now you need to do a destiny montage where you have a, something set to that. <laughs> All right. Give me some tokens near the salad man. Uh, Give me some. I guess that's technically tonight. a start. <laughs> oh, I made Phil sad. I told him about his extreme position, and it's true. We're already in the mentality of fuck nature, Phil. The environment is on fire. Everything is bad. And huge in the way of my sketching right now. Hmm. Have a Lego hand. I mean, they made those Mega Blocks or whatever the fuck the non Lego Legos were that had the Destiny license there for a while. I'm aware, but I'm not drawing his fingers. <laughs> Here's a heart. I didn't really did. like the detailing and so everything funny. else. Because <laughs> what? It's just so jagged and. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to try that one more time. There's got to be some... I mean, there probably isn't, other than... Hours and hours. I mean, even like just that, like... Just like every time I... It's definitely hard. Like, paint.net can be hard to get really nice lines in. 
Yeah, but that's not. But I mean, it's also that's like not what's happening here. <laughs> it's hard to do that with that tablet. Um, I mean, oh I, man, sundial and dying. I believe in you, Phil. I certainly I doodled on um, paper before and run into the same problems. So. Well, that's that's just art muscle repetition, there, sir. Dogs look good. Uh, Armor got in bullshit. That's fine. Uh, Lovely. That's nature. Uh, I don't know. You did everything except his arms and shoulders first. Like a weirdo. It was fun yesterday during that conference to just be doodling bullshit. All day. I haven't really been put in a position where I could do that for a while. It's like without school or anything where I normally did all that. <laughs> that was a lot of fun just to do random stuff. <laughs> Pink fluffy man. I'll go to Walter. I need to look up Crocs. It's good enough. Who cares? Crocs. No, I'm not news. I need... Okay. You don't know what the, want to know what the latest uh, in Crocs is? Oh, Christ. I turned the image. This just looks funny. Just enjoy this for a second. <laughs> just the crock. There. The MSRP was on that original action figure because I think that was collaborate. Well, I'm not sure. I could check. I didn't really it like. Doesn't really matter. Click I was into just curious. I didn't look okay. at, too closely at it, but if you had told me that that was just um, a render, yeah, or like the, the thing that you can definitely tell is in like the cloak and like the fuzz because the fuzz looks jaggedy as fuck. Now you're doing art. By saying God damn it? By hating every second of it. Nah, that's not true. My mom. All right, Lorraine, opinion. For something like this, basically just trying to go straight down. Uh huh. Should I attempt to, like, use my fingers to go down like that? Or should I, like, just, like, plop this down and try to drag my whole hand straight downward? Um, what do you mean by using your fingers? All right, like, in this manner. Which you probably can't quite tell because I'm already it's on I mean, you could, I could see a difference. It's more line. like a this. Like, I'm more like pivoting um, my, thing, my hand around, like, the place where I'm putting my hand on the thing. Whereas my other proposal is to, like, just basically put the cursor down 
and then try to move my whole fist in a downward. I generally do more, um, like, I don't know, like finger and slightly wrist movements as opposed to whole hand movements okay. when I'm doing certain strokes just because it's easier. Um, I feel like I have more control in that regard. Sorry, I'm just... That's my bad hand. Yeah, you're still holding the thing with it, though. Um... His little butt towel. I keep thinking back to when um, I was playing way more Street Fighter and watching fighting game videos online uh, and hearing people describe like uh, badass salarymen in Japan who would, you know, they'd get off shift or whatever and go to the arcade and knock out some games or whatever on their commute home uh, and they would always describe them as like the, like a tightly compact minimally movement, like uh, as opposed to people like <laughs> like Brian, where you see him like slapping the whole thing mm -hmm. with like a lot of force from the hands. They basically move all of their fingers and both of their hands as little as humanly possible yeah. to achieve the inputs required. Uh, and uh, if you have the skill and the discipline, I'm guessing that's probably a good way to do most things. If you want to just repeat the same uh, mm -hmm. the same results over and over and over again. How do, you, how do you like him so far? Oh man, that's great. <laughs> Look at you go. Also, like, man, that's impressive. I you mean, got... I'm going off of... No, like... I know, but you still got, like, so many lines in there so quickly. Like, it's not... I'm just saying, you did good. <clears throat> you, you traced well, or whatever. <clears throat> uh, now I gotta get, like, a beach shovel. Like a tiny little... There we go. Oh, I could give him, like, a... No, I want the scoop. I want the dumb little, like, yeah. He's best. Oh, that's beautiful. Happy. All right, Lorraine, another question. It's not particularly art. In this image, in the image of, like, the Iron Banner insignia or whatever, are these supposed to be like leaves, or are they just kind of nothing? Are they just kind of part of the I composition? Oh, I have of always the... read them as leaves. I need to make this bigger. I wish this transparency. See, look, I don't know how I did that, but that one single little curve was so good. Like, from here to here, it was, like, perfect. I mean, it happens sometimes. I'm going to try to cut the shovel out oh, a little bit more. Let's out a little. Okay, I kind of got most of this side. Get this little hole over here. Uh. Yeah, I don't know. There's just something about... I might have even said it last week, like, you're not last time or whatever. I don't remember, but there's a... Uh... Something about just repetitive hand motions that don't... Uh... necessarily require any specific exacting thought. Correct. Like, I'm pretty sure uh, the principle behind, like... Zen Rock Gardens, you can apply to anything that uh, you can do with uh, just like repetitive menial tasks. That one also, great corner. That's less good. Hey, Brian. Draw this piece of pizza up here. The pizza. That was pretty good. That corner. Yeah. Like, it just, it ha trust me, it happens sometimes. Like, today, when I was uh, 
working on more fucking wreath plates. Uh, every so often, one of those little snake things I do around the edge were just like divine, and the next one would look like it mm -hmm. fell off of a dumpster in China. Uh, Brian, just to catch you up to speed, since you're here a little later, although you can see it in the preview up there. I it guess, is not a Stark there. emblem. This is the Iron Banner emblem. No, that but it's doing. similar. Yeah, it's not. It's not unlike. It's got wolves and fancy shit on it, so it's. It might as well be like a Stark or whatever. This is technically Destiny related. Banana this week. Oh. And I'm doing Saladin. Um, he's beach time Saladin. So he's got Crocs. <laughs> and I'm give, putting, giving him a giant fucking beach shovel. <laughs> Which I think looks hysterical right now. The only th problem is the sketch will be really hard to see on the stream if I try to flip it around. Uh, you can but. still do it for a second. You're right, it's going to be harder to make up than the other one because the lines are so fine, but, uh, here, hold on. Let oh me, no, let me internet. Let me enable that for you. One sec. Uh, oh, I got to click on. Hold on. I believe in you. There. Really so you had it there for a second there. with the lighting, but it's still like kind of hard to make out. But yeah, it uh -huh. you'll see, it'll be better once I. So if you want to update next time, put okay. that in the Dropbox. I should just do that, and then I'll pull here. It up. You know what? Let's. I'll do that right now. Okay. I'm gonna take a snippet gonna try, of this. We'll do it live. Fuck it. Uh, <laughs> um, let me grab this over here. Save. Dropbox. Salad man, salad and man. Actually, what I need? I'm dumb and can't spell. Where poorly. is that at? Which I one? just put it in our Dropbox folder. It's a shared one together. Okay, might even open it and paint up now. It probably will. There you go. There's my that's, man. Uh, There's a sketch right now. That's what Lorraine is. That's where Lorraine's at with yep. her. Uh, He's got his work. Crocs. I'm gonna give him a beach towel. <laughs> um, so, you know, for cake. right now, I'll just leave that up there. You can keep messing with it as you see fit. Oh, no, that's just a um, PNG. I'm not going to... Oh, sure. Like, you won't, you yeah. won't get that. Um, but this one, I am going to save just because I'm paranoid. Oh, I should actually save mine, too. That's not um, a bad idea. Okay, back to the whatever. Uh, Don't take my pen. Where did my pen go? Where did uh, I... It's over here. Where did I put it? Uh, Oh, uh, yeah. This is very silly. I should, I should never be given this amount of power. Like, what is this? What does it do? Everything seems to disappear on the flare. Five, gone. Your one, also gone. I don't need this anymore. Just this layer that Croc is on. Mm -hmm. There we go. I still have. Phil, are you still in here? Can He's you... doing a heroic sundial. Um, oh, okay. Trying I was just going to ask him if he could see heroic. us fine or if, uh, was, if, if there was an issue I mean, or if no, Brian no, think, was having an issue. I think it's on Brian's end. We have no dropped frames right now. I think we're still okay. Uh, but that's just like the render out, not necessarily the um, internet out, if that makes sense. I don't know. How did I do that? Do what? Not over here. All right, I was going to give him some. Can't draw sunglasses without making them look really bad. Sunglasses are your fingers? No, because I I draw them a certain way for like my comics, and it's not right, and so I need to like check myself whenever I draw classes, essentially. Uh, just for the sake of argument, I'm just gonna double check. Oh my god, this is so stupid! It's beautiful, but it's so dumb! Oh, I, I do, it did have, still have the stream up. I guess I'll close it now. I set oh, it up an accident, but it looks fine. So, I mean, it's going. So, I think we're okay. Because uh, if we had an out problem, 
That should have been there. screwed up for us too. Ooh. Yeah, that looks like that needs to be fixed. Brian, if you can hear us, uh, are you anywhere weird? Use it as grandma's house. Okay. I think I'm going to do this. Because uh, we haven't caught up in a while with that. I don't know if that's got... Uh... I like the... Let's try again. Good. I hope it works this time. Um, I do not like the Jeep. Yeah, I don't know what your inner situ internet situation is over there currently. If you have... Uh... Like real service, if you're just rocking a cell phone, or if you're in between, uh, for the moment. But I still, uh, I know you've been crazy busy with shit. Well, I'll, still, I'll wait until I confirm that he's even back. Oh. Here it is. Change size with. On that or that. So, you know, this is maybe a better question for you since you're using that thing or you're usually using the Cintiq. Um, do you find yourself uh, really getting around the canvas uh, or do you do what I'm doing right now, which I think is also just more suited to a device like this, which is to move the center of the canvas much more than to move my hand across? Because I have a lot more Probably using twenty percent of the space available on this thing. It's much harder to do to draw inside that, of, but um, on one of these, just because the image is already is on the screen that you're drawing on. Mm -hmm. um, but I do try to move uh, around a lot more. And one of the nice things about um, Clip Studio Paint is that you can rotate the canvas without rotating the image. That makes sense. Uh, yeah, I think so. Like I could have this on a weird angle, uh -huh. and the image itself hasn't changed. Right. But I can do it to make a better, which I should do more. Because I'm bad and dumb sometimes. Ah, okay. Gotcha. That makes sense. Uh, cool. Well, yeah, uh, you know, you do what you got to do. And that also is so dependent because our, like, um, our actual cell phone service in this house is pretty shitty. Like, some t in some rooms it's fine, in some rooms it's less fine. If you're in the basement, it doesn't work at all for sure. Yeah. Um, but I'm always, like, I won't get, I'll have calls drop sometimes in here if I'm not on the Wi-Fi, mm -hmm. so. Devices, man, none of them work exactly the way you fucking want them to. Uh. But yeah. Okay. I mean, that's a lot of it, honestly. As far as outlining goes. Oh, I forgot all that. Well, get to that in a second. So I'll do this little nub, and then I'll do under part here, and then I'll do those little droplet leaves thingies, and then I'll go from there. But anyway, uh, is it at least a little better now? Can you, like, sort of make us out? I don't remember what the mobile app settings are like for Twitch, but if you can even just um, yeah, set the video to, like, as low as humanly possible and can hear us, that'd be something. Doop. Hey, look at that. I closed that loop. I just did it. I feel like a badass. Mage god. Or badass new god. Bad that's what it was. A badass new god. Oh, fuck. I did that. Uh... Pen. Hmm. Nice. Uh... Yeah, that works. Do what I told you. 
that line easier to fucking close. Saladin's helmet. <laughs> That's pretty good. I'm actually, I'm still like, I did this last week too. I'm really being a lot more cavalier mm -hmm. than I usually am when I do my art streams. And I think that would maybe help me a little bit more when I do those, but I just can't bring myself to do it then. Do you think uh, part of it is even just your posture? Like I said, we can, um, I don't think that would help though. Mess with some of the other seating and the table and stuff in there if you think it would, uh, I personally don't good. Well, because I still do, like let me know. punch like that at work, and I know I shouldn't, but I do it anyway. We all do it, and I have a high-backed chair there, like just basically an office chair, essentially. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Get his fluff in. It's really obnoxious. Christ. What's in Christ? Racer was too big. I'm liking this other pen though. That's nice. The marker that I'm using to do the outline with. Mm -hmm. I definitely need to experiment more with some of the settings in Clip Studio Paint because there's a lot in here that I just don't use because I don't know what it does. Um, I put my phone. I put my phone too. Put my phone up. <laughs> okay. Um. This, uh, but that's all I got. I've still got the piano man playing in my head, so don't at me. Do I don't care. <laughs> Buffering hell, no. Aw, oh, that sucks. Lame, lame, lame. If only we had like a text-to-speech thing or something. This is the hardest to chat in the chat chat, because we've got all four of our collective hands occupied. That said, I can try it to go back and forth a little bit. Uh, First, I gotta zoom in and see what the new is. I wish it was easier to incorporate my um, surface onto the screen, like onto the stream itself. Mm -hmm. I mean, we could do it. Eh. But, uh, like I said, we could do it easy if you wanted to just do that for one day, because that's. Um... Yeah, I wish we could flip between them, though, is my. Uh huh. I mean, we could do that point. too. It would be like a little harder, but not impossible by any means. Um... Uh, what about zooming out? Checking how far I had gotten on each side of that thing. Dogs look so bad. Here's you. Fight like an animal. I think that's a hunter only line. I think Shax is like. I'm not sure. He's like, I always tell people you're, I don't try to, or it's either Guardian or Hunter, I don't remember which one it is. Mm -hmm. like, Who cares? You fight like an animal. I think that thing he says about the Red Jacks is only for Hunters, but yeah, he said it to like me sometimes on the Red as a Warlock, so. so he you need a Warlock like you in the Red Jacks? No, he says the Hunter line. <laughs> but he did, I don't know when it was. I think he stopped doing it now, but there was some point where he it's was just occasionally saying it to me for no reason. Uh, I mean, you were having a hell of a time with the the knife last night. What can I say? Throwing knives are silly and fun. You're a solar hunter, is that what you're telling me? Maybe. Somebody hasn't experienced the joy of being a void hunter, though. I don't know if you have that room in your heart. Be invisible. Well, they're not, you don't need to be void to use them on air when you're... Any... Oops. 
Is the um Is that the um subclass that has the strongest benefit from just performing a dodge? Do the any of the other trees do anything that dodge doesn't already do Ooh. by dodging? Ooh. Thanks. And it's it's just the tether classes. Like if you were a Gwyson, it's top or bottom. Yeah, yeah, if you were a Gwyson, uh or not a Gwyson, a Shadow Vector Hunter, you don't turn invisible. Or no, I don't. I think it's even just top tree because okay. bottom tree is the one where you throw the smoke quivers. Uh, sm you throw the smoke bomb and get it. Um, so it's literally just a perk of top tree void. Okay. In my case, is best void. But quiver has quivers fun too. Spectral. I just don't think I like roaming supers personally. Like doing them. There's too much riding on them. Makes me anxious. Uh, that's why I don't really like um, Arc Staff that much. And I don't like Golden Gun because I can't aim. I like Nighthawk because it's one and done. <laughs> Here's his arm. No, this is the rest of it. Okay. I've also been experimenting more with non-black outline. Like right now I'm using a slightly grayer one. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, of course, I can do that. Spectral mid-tree gets invis when you get a headshot KO while crouched. That's kind of neat. That's good to know. Yeah, they oh, all have God. their own invisibility abilities. So bad. Invisibilities. So it's crouched headshots, dodges, and just throwing the smoke the bomb. The smoke bomb. And wall hacks. wall hacks. Oh, yeah, you get true sight as well. In that instance, the spectral one. Mm-hmm. I have had some fun with Spectre Blades, but again, I'm not... Of the roaming supers that hunters can do, being, I would consider, uh, Golden Gun a roaming super. I mean, it is classified as such as well. It is and it isn't. Like, it definitely is in the sense that you move around and use mm -hmm. it, but it's not in the sense that, no, like... No, I know, yeah. Oh. Uh, it's not like a storm trance or yeah. a hammer or... Like, when Wade half took objection to our complaining about to the other day about hunters being so fucking... Resilient in their supers. I feel like Golden Gun's the only one that is like probably appropriately balanced because sure. you can kill people. Yes, it's a roaming super where you walk around with it and use it, but you can kill people from either any distance with the precision one, mm -hmm. or you know, forty or fifty meters out. I think it's more like forty-ish, uh, maybe even a little less now. Oh, uh, with the six shot or whatever. Um, after they rebalanced them. Uh, whereas the other ones, the Arc Staff and the um, Spectral Blade, they basically complete compete uh, mobility wise and like range attack wise with like the Titan and the Warlock ones. Except they just win those fights for no reason. <laughs> just oh, it takes two hits to kill them and one hit to kill the kill the ones they're fighting. Uh, which to me is a little wild, but whatever. I'm not sure how hard it would be to change that math. It could very well be kind of difficult, but uh, I think it would be sort of neat if they all two shot each other. So then you did have to like play spacing around yeah. a little bit in like weird super duels uh, to a larger extent than you do now duels. if you squish up against people who are already in their supers. Yeah, or whatever. Okay, that is still his jobs, I guess you could say. Kind of places. Yeah, the throwing knife is silly and fun. Glad you don't still irrationally hate hunters. The class to play, they're Other no, they're cool, and like... I don't even I don't even hate them. It's just uh, their mobility options are kind of crazy. 
It's just a little, uh, I mean, like, I'm not even the 10,000th person to say that or whatever. We had conversations on the podcast about it or whatever, but the power of the, um, other, the, it's the power of the hunter jump in PvP is so crazy versus, like, the base warlock jumps, uh, in terms of utility, where the hunter jump goes up fast and, uh, and it goes up fast and falls fast, basically. Uh, like, it falls faster so that you're, like, you can get out of situations or get over people very quickly. Um, but you're also not just, like, a sitting duck in, uh, in the sky like you are with, uh, like, Top Tree Dawnblade on Warlock or whatever. Or even, like, any of the Warlock or Titan jumps are just less like that than the Hunter jumps are. Uh... Uh, so you can get out of, like, scary situations both directions faster than the other classes do. You can get up quicker and down quicker. Uh, and with stoppies or whatever, you just jump, like, 60 feet in the air. And uh, So that's another thing where it's, like, way different per platform, where I don't think it's nearly as big a deal on PC. Mm -hmm. Like, it's a big deal, but it's not, uh, you know, when you can move the mouse cursor and rotate your... Miles an hour. and you Right, and you can rotate your field of view, like... 360 degrees instantly, like, fr or from any plane. Like, you can go up, down, left, right at basically the same speed. Uh, it doesn't matter. Basically anymore. immediately, right. It's not like the joystick where even on 10 sensitivity or whatever. Uh, assuming you could control it, you can only move that fucking thing so fast. Uh, oh, fuck me. Why? <laughs> Now you're doing art. Did trace that whole side. So. There's got to be a time. good pun in something about going to the beach in Iron Banner, but I'm not sure what it is yet. on that. Fires are lit. Time to go to Cabo, Guardian. That's just dumb. That's neither fun nor sick. This I do have to check. Yeah, it'll be fine. Coming along. <laughs> he sure is. Look at you go. And this is just lines over different lines. I'm just gonna keep letting this rock, letting this rock, and keep on it. That's essentially what I'm doing. Comes out jagged and bad. It's still because it's either natural or, you know, it's like old or whatever. Saladin's old as fuck. Is Saladin like golden age? I think so. I remember like bits and pieces of the like. For, I watched the entirety of the four hour long um, My Name is Bife mm -hmm. uh, build up to Shadow Keep video in one go. I mean, don't quote me on it, because I'm no Destiny lore smith or anything. Please tell me. But I feel like the Iron Lords were like pre Guardians, whatever era that is in the Destiny history. Lightbringers or whatever? Lightbearers? Uh, I think is what they were you've called. already remembered more than I do about whatever that lore was. Well. <laughs> Or Kyle, one of you. You're here. Chronicler. Mm. 
Nope. Um, more to your point about um, drawing stuff even. I there's a much I would say there's a much bigger learning curve with a tablet like that than how I'm drawing. This is a lot more natural. Whereas that's a little disjointed because of the disconnect between what you're seeing and what you're doing. Maybe. I mean, I noticed that when I was using that for however long I did. Decent amount of time. Years. Or take. Oh, that's a lot of text. I'm assuming that's our answer. And then I glanced over at it and screwed uh, up my uh, line. The first one, I teleported back into the sundial room, and the spinning blades killed me instantly. <laughs> after the rest was... Oh, no! Well. Ugh. Rip. Thanks, video game. That's so unfortunate. I'm so sorry. Oh, well. Wasn't sure if you were still in that or not. No, I'm just. Move it. That's fine. I hate that circle. How weird is that, actually? What? Hating a circle? No, that look, the, the tree branches, this one is not the same. It's like, this uh -huh. is disconnected. Pretty sure it actually is disconnected. Also, oh, the Iron like Lords that. are proto guardians, yeah, but post war lords or whatever they were called. Those are like the bad guys. The first guardians to realize the decided to protect humanity's whole their power. Aww. And they lived up in wherever that terrible the map that I hate is. Vostok. That one. You could hang out there in Destiny One. Those are basically corrupt guardians. Oh, so that's what we're going to be once the drifter way. I think Saladin might have been there all the time in Destiny 1 in that other public zone. I don't remember oh, what his purpose was if Iron Banner wasn't running. He probably did something. Like a core now. Maybe it's all a blur. Okay. I mean, fuck, you can't go there anymore, so it's probably still hanging out up there in Destiny 2, technically. Huh. He's gotta be somewhere where he ain't, when he ain't in the tower. The baby. Mm -hmm. Can't see no Saladin, he's not real. I was free of the piano man. A handful of minutes. And then it just like decided to assert itself again. Saladin showed up for Iron Banner in Vanilla D1 and became a major vendor yeah. for the Rise of Iron. I, I remember, because I think that that area, I may, I'm not, it might not be true. I thought that area might have showed up in Rise of Iron, but maybe it might have been before that. But so that was the last Destiny. Rise of Iron expansion. was the, yeah. If you, uh,. If you assume that, um, actually, I don't even remember if that's true, because it was Dusty 1 and then fucking Taken King, and then Rise of Iron. I don't remember if there was another one or not. It might, I think that was just the, the sequence of releases of, like, big September expansions. Mm, uh, okay.
Okay, it's time for the first craft. Like I said, all that other stuff, I had totally forgotten most of it. Um, because I never played that game on a consistent okay. basis. I played it whenever the new content came out. Uh, so I had forgotten that um, like Mar and Aldrin or whatever had their own little public zone. The funny thing is, though, I vividly remember that. Because uh, I remember seeing you go there right. a few times. So I knew who Mara was when I started playing Forsaken. Mm -hmm. I was like, oh, right, it's the blue lady. I didn't remember Aldrin. But they blew it up in Taken King, so yeah. I was just like, oh, that just, just never registered to me that it had ever been there in the first place. It was just gone after that. You went Vanilla Crota, House of Wolves, Taken King. Some stuff probably Rise of Iron. <laughs> no, I got you. Wasn't there, like, a SIVA thing? I remember seeing that in the... Uh, oh, that's cool. The Bife video. Hold on. Something with, like, corrupt dudes. I don't know if that was its own expansion. Was that House of Wolves? Weren't there any paid releases after Taking King, but before Rise of Iron? Iron was the SIVA... Oh, okay, Iron was the SIVA expansion. I remember seeing, I think that was a raid? Or there was a raid in that? I remember seeing stuff from that, and that looked messed up. Some freaky, like, jacked up fallen dudes. Yikes. Oh, no, no. That is kind of... Yeah, because they had intermittent expansions, but the big oh, ones Lord, were, I did want to double check, the big ones were, the, the gigantic September releases were, were the Taken King and Rise of Iron in 2015 and 2016, respectively. Were there only two years of Destiny 1? Uh, well, there was then there was the whole year. There's three years, basically. Oh, there was three, okay. Because there was the full first year, and oh, then that, right, right, that right, right. ended with uh, Taken, Taken King. King, and then there was the full second year, which ended with Rise of Iron, right. and there was the full third year, which ended with Destiny 2. Bang. Uh, so yeah, if, if Destiny 2 were on the same timeline as Destiny 1, which I do not think it is by it, any means, it's just a different product at this point, but if it were, Destiny 3 would be out this year, but I... D2 about to outlive D1. Yeah, I assume that this year we'll yeah, get another, cool. hopefully an expansion that's closer to the size of um, Forsaken than Shadowkeep, but mm -hmm. maybe not. <laughs> It'll really depend on how... Uh, fleshed out each of the seasons are by themselves at this point, I think. I would uh, be really interested to see um, a an expansion with the um, main story, like campaign stuff of Forsaken, but with the promised theoretical um, connectivity that Shadowkeep is allegedly going to have. Like seeing the expansions kind of bleed into each other would be cool mm -hmm. and if they kind of came back to the main story of the whole year that would be real neat um but wishful ramblings of a story craving guardian she wrote into it like a dear abby style <laughs> mm -hmm. destiny uh a dear uh dear speaker yep or story craving in Cincinnati or whatever. Story craving in the drain. <laughs> it was the first EDZ lost sector I could think of. I almost just said EDZ, but that seemed a little too generic. As much as I'm still not a big fan of the first person shooter genre, I have I really like I've in, very much enjoyed my time with uh Destiny 2 and I still think it's the our group aspect of it. I definitely wouldn't have stuck with it this long playing on my own 100%. I don't find I I have some drive because I've been playing it for a good amount. Um, but there's no drive for me to just better myself on my own in a vacuum. I like playing with my favorite part. Uh, do you like 
the gameplay at all a little more over time in a vacuum, though, would you say? Because, uh, like I said... Probably. I mean, just because I've gotten better at it. Like, the uh, genre itself itself still does not appeal to me. Because mm-hmm. that's how I felt about um, that Final Fantasy XIV experiment, with the exception that I was like... I, I don't know. My distaste for the gameplay couldn't overcome the enjoyment I got of just, like, dipping in to check it out. Like, I was glad we tried it out, and it was kind of fun to fuck with little bits of it together. <laughs> but, man, do I not, like traditional just like one two three-ing across the keyboard MMO style mm-hmm. gameplay. And I'd never um I'd never tri- tried that before because I never played like WoW or anything. Mm-hmm. So going in I had no um benchmark for it. And I I'm of the same uh, mindset. I I don't like that kind of game. But it was fun to play again while um we were all doing it together. Definitely another thing I wouldn't go off and do solely on my own. Oh, this poor tree. Chop it down. <laughs> I'm like... Yeah, I can't. I can't imagine people who play oh, Destiny fuck. One completely solo. It just seems so lonely <laughs> i mean not just for being alone but just the game i the game itself is so entrenched in the multiplayer experience like being in voice chat constantly mm-hmm. um just sort of paying attention but also kind of not uh and just having a grand time mm-hmm. i mean i played most of that game solo like i dipped in with Phil and them on like the, i think that was all pretty much after the fact though like i don't think i did any of that raid content concurrently with when it was released in D1. I think, yeah, I think we did a bunch of it in the Rise of Iron Era, because I think that's the technically the time I played it the longest in one single, like, stint. Like the, the... I mean, I remember that one, the first time I think we had a Destiny Day at Phil's, um, it was when you guys were doing whatever, I think that was the Crota Raid. Mm-hmm. I remember watching parts of that, um, again, kind of like the, um, the Mara thing, fairly vividly. I always forget his stupid little... What towel? Because it's so small, and he has a cape, too. Pick a class, Saladin. Like, kind of, Jared? Christ. Not that, Jared. How far along are you, Lorraine? What you're sitting out to do? Because I'm thinking, uh... I just follow up with this more next week. I don't, I don't know what to call it. So this Iron Banner picture is going to outlive the current Iron Banner. I guess is what I'm saying. Uh, we'll see. I'll finish filling this stuff out. Well, I guess we'll just restart this for a second and then whatever. All right, uh, my computer crashed again because it's good. I lost most of what I was doing, so I think I'm done for the night. <laughs> Cause everything's great. Uh, anyway, Lorraine, I want you to share your part. Hey, welcome back, Ryan. Dead times. Oh, shut up. I mean, we lost the... Hmm? Dad, because we lost the... Dustin's progress. He had a lot more done on his picture. <sighs> there. I sent it. Uh. Oh, hold on. I'll just... Yeah. I guess I could here. I got it. I got it. No, I have. I want to sh- add the sketch for what else is going to be in here to it. Okay. Renaming it the same thing.
No, it's all on the same PC. I mean, yeah, the, his drawing is on the same PC. Mine is on the Surface. So if you get, that should be the right one. Each salad man too. That's pretty good. He's gonna have sunglasses and he's gonna have a beach shuffle. Quite good. Really stupid. Uh, so at least we've got that. Hooray! Yeah. I don't know. Drug. <laughs> Probably won't come back to this at this point. We'll see. <laughs> uh, yes, he has Crocs on. Yeah, let's go back to. Maybe next time we'll just have Lorraine finish this. Uh, I mean, I was just going <laughs> to. I mean, you can if you want to. I mean, unless you'd rather me finish. Because I don't know how you're going to get. I'm not going to use that tablet to do this. No, I can pipe it on the capture card just like anything else, like gameplay. Um, but it's up to you. If you felt like doing that next week, I would totally do that if you wanted to just finish it up then. Uh, but if you want to just keep looking around with it. Yeah, I'd probably rather just. Waste it away. How much longer do you think you got? I mean, I can do this either more tonight or tomorrow. Like, no big deal. Uh, it doesn't matter. I don't even know what I want to do now. Put my head in the oven. No. Oh. <laughs> don't um. do that. Well, yeah, I think we'll, I guess we'll still just call the stream for now, and either Lorraine will pick this up next week, or she'll just Yikes. keep doing that uh, offline or whatever, and I mean, I'm gonna do it offline. try to come I'm... up with something else to do next week. I don't even know what. I was gonna go take a knee and, I don't know, do something. <laughs> anyway. Uh, Welcome to yeah, work. I'm so glad the computers work well. Yeah. Uh, anyway, thanks for hanging out, Brian. I'll, uh... Yeah, right. That would work out better if you got something. Um, anyway, yeah, good to see a couple of you guys for a little bit. Uh, Brian, the next time, uh, I know you've been crazy busy, but I want to hang out at some point, so the next time you think you've got some free time, give us a heads up, and we'll, uh, we'll figure something out and catch up and chill out for a little bit. Uh, Brian's going to keep making art. I'm going to find a way to keep doing something. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, until next time, uh, I guess we'll probably do something next Thursday. So Maybe. Maybe it won't crash. Who knows? See you later. Bye.